This past summer, I fulfilled a longtime dream of mine of purchasing a charming country home surrounded by a fragrant forest full of tall pines and hardwoods on 20 private acres in an idyllic small southern town where everybody is nice and hospitable. In this video, I'm going to do a tour of my dream rural property that includes a tour of my newly furnished custom four bedroom country home that is surrounded by a forest with private trails, an underground bunker, a shooting range, and enough private land to create a small farm. Stay tuned. Let's go for a ride. <laughs> subscribe today hey guys whatever you do make sure you're wearing the gear to stay safe out there on the streets and i have some awesome gear if you want to get it i have links to everything like this armored hoodie which is awesome my ultra lightweight carbon fiber helmet that comes with an automatic tent shield my motor vlog camera airbag vest all my gear i include links in the description and comment section of this video just recently i purchased a painting that eerily reminds me of my driveway to my country property in the middle of the woods. This is my place of refuge to de-stress. This is my zen. This is my love. Nature, this is God's country. A great, big, beautiful parcel of land with so much beauty and the opportunity to live off the land and the enjoyment of two wheels that moves the soul on these wonderful trails in this amazing forest and know that I always have my underground bunker to escape to when the emergency arises. This house was built in 2007 and the previous owners only use it as a vacation home two weeks out of the year. So if you add it all up since 2007 they stayed in this house less than a year and this house is like brand new. I'll tell you very immaculate and so you can see here I love the stone work here on the front it's really nice I love the two-tone two-tone gray that's really nice beautiful uh, front porch here of course you got to have a pair of rocking chairs <laughs> out in the country and it's really awesome just sitting in the rocking chairs here and looking out in the countryside very peaceful and quiet I tell you I really really love it out here you get a lot of good quality sleep fresh air that the trees provide it's on a slab foundation it is three bedrooms and a bonus room really I, really it's a four bedroom house with uh, two and a half two full bathrooms and one half bathroom has a two car garage uh, it has I believe that's a 500 gallon propane tank that is only for the generator so got skittle diddles here with the kennel here there's the well house you see there Got the system there has a heater in there too in case it ever gets down to freezing temps you can turn the uh, heater light on by the way this is a rainwater catch container for extra water the shooting range is in back of the house down in the woods and what's cool about this area is that we all shoot here when I first came here the neighbor told me he said hey we all shoot here so just letting you know and I said that's good with me <laughs> some of you guys mentioned that you got to be careful of any you know any stray shots but there's probably a good probably t tons of acres before there's another another neighbor on that side so that's really not to worry but I plan on using uh, shooting some buckshot as you can see here here I probably need to load it up with some more logs um, but I put like a target here and and I'll probably uh, use rubber ammo, so uh, I'll be extra cautious with that. But here's the back here. The woods, this forest looks so much prettier in the spring and summer and fall. Right now it's winter time, so obviously all the leaves are off and it's barren. But I do have these tall pine trees here, are really beautiful. And what's awesome about this forest is there's a lot of pine straw on the floor of the forest which helps prevent bushes from growing and it's very very quiet here extremely quiet and uh, very fragrant beautiful I love coming here it's very peaceful um, very healthy clears your sinuses your thoughts very zen I love it 
And as you can see, there's a house up there and there's trails that go all around the property. HVAC system they just installed in 2019 very efficient my energy bills are very low like 38 40 bucks and got this little table set here on a rear patio and it has a beautiful view of course of the forest here okay now to do a tour inside my country winter home here in Georgia and as you see here when you walk in the first thing you notice is real hardwood floors and this place is like brand new like i said the previous owners stayed in it very little but and another thing you notice is windows great big windows beautiful view of the forest and countryside is really nice and here in the dining room you notice it has tray ceiling here which is a nice touch and cathedral ceiling here in the living room, 15 foot tall. And by the way, this dining room set here, I inherited from my grandmother, my late grandmother that passed away in uh, 2019. But this dining room set goes way back to when I was a teenager and there was a lot of family get togethers with this dining room set. A lot of memories attached to this dining room set. And there's the hutch, buffet hutch that it came with as well. And by the way, this painting here, by the way, I have links to a lot of things you see in this house in the description and comment section of this video. And this is one of them. It's a painting I got here from online. And man, this reminds me of my driveway, except I have tall pine trees, but it looks just like that as you're driving uh, to my country property here. And uh, by the way, this area rug here I just picked up, which I thought was a nice touch, which I have a link to, by the way, as well. That design matches up with the chandeliers design, which I thought was kind of cool. Um, but yeah, I really love the windows, man. I just love when I walk in here and just see the beautiful countryside there. Very zen and peaceful, beautiful. Uh, here's the living room here. I have a black leather couch set here that I brought with me from Ohio because I had an extra set. And I'm so ghetto that I left a tag on here. <laughs> Glove soft leather. This, and I've had this since like 2003, I think, this set, man. But I hardly use it, so it's still like brand new. 
But uh, you know, these end tables here, I, I thought were a nice touch. Uh, the end table lights and end tables I have links to, by the way. And I've got another area rug here underneath a coffee table that matches the dining room uh, carpet there. And as you can see here, I installed a, a 75 inch LED TV and sound bar, and there's a subwoofer there, and I installed this myself. And I tell you, this was a beast installing this. <laughs> I have a link to this TV, by the way. And I tell you, the sound bar, this Polk sound bar, which is fairly inexpensive, what it comes with this wireless sub there. Man, the sound is awesome. <laughs> For the price you pay, it's amazing. Of course, you got a fireplace here. And the house has an eat-in kitchen with a counter and stools, as you see there, which is really nice. We got the uh, you know, table here. And I love sitting here and eating breakfast and looking out into the forest there. It's really nice. And uh, I've got the kitchen here with the, with the cherry cabinets. Just a basic kitchen here, as you see here. It does have a dishwasher. Um, electric stove, it's all electric house, refrigerator, basic, and got your area rug there. Like I said, window on the door, I like that, love that touch. And it does have a laundry room here, which is nice here. Here's the master bedroom, which also has tray ceilings as well. And look at the great big windows all around. You can see the beautiful forest. And uh, I picked up this headboard, by the way, I have a link to, which I think is, is really nice and, and not expensive either. And here's a painting, beautiful country road, it kind of looks like out here, which I thought was nice. The whole country theme. And it does have a walk-in closet here. Here's a walk-in closet. You can see here. Yep, got my motorcycle stuff there. Um, got a corner desk here, and I have desks in every room, so anybody that, that comes here, they can uh, do a work vacation. I have uh, fiber optic high-speed internet access here, which I recently got, which is awesome. And I tell you, that's gold out here in the country, man. Uh, here's the master bathroom here. You can see here, double sinks. Um, picked up this art piece here. I, um, I have a link to this if you want to get that. It's really nice. Great big tub here. Got a window here. A toilet. And it has a shower here too. See here, a separate shower. And okay, I'll take you to the other side of the house. It's a split bedroom setup with two bedrooms on this side and a full bath, and of course the master bedroom on this side with the master bath. And in here, the front room here, as you see here, it has really tall vaulted ceilings here, dual closets. Um, I have, see, windows, just nothing but windows. I love that little arch up there. That's a nice touch. And you can see here, isn't that nice? The deer, yep. I got the a desk here, like I said, desk in every room. And it has like a little nook here, like a little area here. You can sit here and read a book or whatnot. And it has storage, storage underneath as well. It's nice, you can just sit here, watch TV, read a book, whatever. Really nice. Okay, next room here is the bathroom. Here, shower, tub, basic bathroom here. Really nice, and check this out. Got a painting here with horses. Got this for my mom. She loves horses. And here's the back room here. As you can see here, same headboard, which I have a link to if you want to get. And these end table lamps are nice. And end, end tables here on each side of the bed, or nightstands, whatever you want to call them. Corner desk here. I have a link to that if you want to get that as well. Great big window here look out into the forest gaze into the forest meditate it's nice got a closet there 
Got this here, check this out, painting here. Very zen, very peaceful. De-stressing, that's what this property is all about, de-stressing. Zen, meditate, appreciate life. You know, life is short, enjoy it and appreciate it. Here's a bonus room up here, which really is just a fourth bedroom. But I use it as my office and it can be used as a bedroom and as a half bathroom up here as well. See there. I've got these chairs, by the way. Um, I have a link to these if you want to get them. Very inexpensive and awesome. Great bang for your buck. They're recliners. It has a massage feature on there, which is really nice. Puts vibration on your lower back. Really nice. I have, Like I said, I have a link to those if you want to get them. Got a twin XL bed there. Got the L-shaped desk here. And my work and everything I need to do. Got another, what, 50 inch uh, TCL TV here, which I have a link to if you want to get this one as well. Um, got the drawers here. See there, you can sit here and watch some TV. And I'll probably be putting like a surround sound system here when I get a chance. There's a half bathroom here. You can see here. I got like a little setup there where you can hang your clothes and uh, you know storage put your shoes on the bottom there it's really nice it's nice to have a half bathroom up here i'll tell you you don't have to go downstairs every time you have to go to the bathroom and it's nice it has a big you know, window here gaze outside um got the full wood blinds here see there I have a link to these if you want to get those as well yeah, and as you walk downstairs, there's a huge, huge, huge uh, painting here. Ridiculously big. And this was a son of a gun to put up, too, I'll tell you guys. But see, that's a painting of a country road. I love country, man. I love country roads. I love country everything. I love country music now. <laughs> that's almost all I listen to now, I'll tell you. I got some great country music out now. Here is the two-car garage here. Really, really, I feel very blessed. And I'll tell you, it was a long journey. Long, long, tough journey to get this. I almost gave up on looking for a country property. Um, because every one that I bid on, I lost out on. Because everybody, the mama wants to live in the country. With a lot of bidders that are bidding properties up over $100,000 plus over list price. And, uh, and I almost gave up. And, uh, but I tell you that if it wasn't for me putting in a cash offer on this property i never would have got it because the i was the second lowest bidder but mine was the only all cash offer and she accepted me i only paid thirty eight hundred dollars over list price which is awesome because <laughs> a lot of the other properties i bid way over that like 30 30 35 thousand over list man which is crazy uh but I tell you, for those of you that are looking for a country property, I tell you, make sure that you do all the research. OK, do all the research. Um, make check neighbors. I mean, have the well water checked. Um, septic checked. Um, make sure there's no no issues with with easements or anything or shared driveways. Uh, make sure you get. A, uh, have them do a survey of the land make sure it doesn't uh, there's no issues you know boundary issues and I tell you there's a lot involved just go online and look at everything you need to do before you buy a country country home because trust me you don't want to have any problems and uh, I tell you this is a dream come true for me and for those of you that want to get a country property I hope you attain your dream as well so that concludes this tour guys um, I appreciate all you guys I got a lot of motor vlogs coming up out here in the country on the electric bike, my YZ Supermoto. I want to get another motorcycle, so there's a lot more, more to come. Make sure to stay tuned. Make sure to leave a comment below. Like, share, subscribe. I appreciate all you guys. Make sure to check out my other channel, Bug Out Moto. So until next time, catch you guys later. Thumbs up. Check out my playlist for new riders and popular videos. Don't forget to comment and subscribe and check out my other channel, Bug Out Moto, where I customize a van for my motorcycle so I can live in my van with my motorcycle and travel across the country anywhere. 
subscribe to my YouTube channel, Bugout Moto.